Hey, it's Corey King SE here, and today I'll be showing you how to muzzle flash using Final Cut Express or Pro. I'm using I'm using Pro because it's what I have. And to get the muzzle flash, you're gonna go to DetonationFilms.com. I already have it up. I'll provide it in the description. But DetonationFilms.com, and you're gonna go. Well, it'll give you this screen here. I'll start. You're going to click on the picture, then go to effects and stock footage. And then you're going to go down to muzzle flashes and gun effects. Right there. And you're going to click page K through 2. And then you're going to go down for a sec. Go down a little until it gets to uh, cannon fire. Then you're going to click on cannon side 01. Download the free zip file. Then it'll make it into a QuickTime .mov file. And that's what it's going to look like at first. So once you do that, you're going to get it and you're going to drag it. I already have it in there, but you're going to drag it to the browser in Final Cut. And then I have my clip that I want. To, that's the clip before adding that. So if I want it right um, right there, I'm going to get it and I'm going to drag it right where I want, wanted my clip. Then you're going to trim the beginning because if you don't trim the beginning this is what it's going to look like. It shows a detonation film things at, a detonation films title at the bottom. So you're going to trim the beginning just a little bit. Drag it like right there. Um, here a little bit sooner. Right there is probably good. Yeah. So, to get this black to go away, you're going to right click, go to composite mode, multiply or screen. Screen is the only one that works on black, and multiply works on white. So, you're going to click screen. And there's the smoke. So, to move the smoke, you're going to go to image wireframe. Move it to where um, it's probably like right there. It's probably good. Right there. So then I'm going to render this. Oh. Um, rendering and this is what it should look like once you're done right there I'm not gonna do the other ones because I don't really want to do it again but detonationfilms.com I'll provide it in the description very simple and that's how to add a muzzle flash using Final Cut